pronatalism is saying shouldn't all religious people who believe in it in it's her or no hell be anti-natalists uh considering that there is a risk associated with their uh progenies ending up in eternal hell huh yeah i guess so i mean given that most belief systems believe that most people are going to end up in hell i mean the way you address that okay so here's the interesting thing okay um, studies show that most people become less happy after they have children okay uh, i think the ratio was like 80 to 20 right so i f i don't remember if this was the accurate number but if you measure the people's happiness 80 percent of people who among all the people who have children 80 percent of them report less uh, less levels of happiness after they had child children compared to before right um but everybody who's planning to have children thinks they're going to be part of that 20 percent okay they're like they're just very optimistic they're like i'm not going to be i'm not going to be that 20 80 percent yes it's 80 percent but there's also 20 percent i'm going to be that 20 percent um so I'm assuming that a lot of parent, like if you bring this to people's attention, that apparently most people are going to go to hell. So why would have why have a child where there's a high chance that your child is going to go to hell? You're just going to be up just the same way that people are optimi are optimistic about their own happiness uh, when they have when they have child, even unrealistically um, optimistic. I'm assuming that they they would be unrealistically optimistic about their children going to heaven as well. Um, the same way that they're unrealistically optimistic based on the stats that they're going to go to heaven as well, right? Like they, they themselves, like forget the children, they themselves think that they're going to go to heaven. Um, even like, even if you believe in Islam, okay, you are, there's so many different versions of Islam and you are very confident that your version of Islam is the right version of Islam, right? Even though statistically uh, the odds are against you. So given that how many, how many people are optimistic that they're going to be different, I'm assuming that they're not going to be uh, anti-natalists and they're going to have children. Atheist Republic needs your help. We have been the target of many legal attacks by Hindu nationalists ever since our founder, Armin Ababi, blasphemed against Hindu deities. We have retained legal counsel to help us defend our access to our community in India. We have started a fundraiser that will help us afford to tackle many legal issues, including judicial harassment and censorship. Whatever you can contribute will go a long ways in helping us in this fight. Link in the description below.